Well, hello everybody. Hello. And happy spooky season. We are here, so excited, for HHN Orlando 2024. 24, I felt like just yesterday was HHN Orlando 2022, and now here we are. We're so excited to scope out the new mazes and the scare zone and maybe the cheeky drinks and food, although we did stop at Finnegan's. We did, it yes. was great. Really, really good. We just needed a quiet place, no pun intended. <laughs> and we found a quiet place. We got a cheeky drink and some food just to chill for a bit. But now we are ready for scares and action. And what else are you excited about, Mom? Spooky. Spooky. Well, I guess that goes in the category of scares, but yes. it's okay. Happy Halloween. <laughs> Happy hunt season, everybody. We've had a great Orlando trip and it's about to get even better because this is opening night of HHN and our first haunt of the year for spooky season 2024. It's gonna be great. I think first up, we're gonna check out A Quiet Place, which most definitely will probably not be quiet. What do you think? You know, I can't wait because that's one of my favorite movies. Yeah, it'll be, I'm interested to see how that maze is gonna play out, but I bet it'll be great. We also maybe wanna check out Ghostbusters. It is a very busy day, but we will try to hit up a couple mazes. I also hear there's a spooky Renaissance Fair going on somewhere. We will. Really spooky. We've been to a Renaissance Fair, but not a haunted one. So we'll see how that goes. Well, everybody, the monsters are starting to come out and the fog is starting to come out too. So I think that is our cue to get this party started. Follow us along, why don't you, to HHN Orlando 2024. allowed to film inside and we always follow rules but we did record our um, screams in the maze I guess and some of the sounds in it even though there weren't a lot of sounds so here's just a tiny little preview of what's to come if you go through the maze <laughs> a rather quiet place, but there was lots going on. That's for sure. I don't want to give away too much, but there was a little bit of sound, but very subtle. If ever there was a sound somewhere, a crack or something falling, something like that, then, well, it definitely alerted the monsters and then perhaps they might hunt you. So be careful if you hear a sound somewhere. What did you think overall, Mom? How would you rate it? Okay, uh, remember this is first night, opening yes. night. I thought the uh, characters looked just like the movie. Uh, oh, yeah. I thought they did a great job. Um, I was expecting maybe a little more, but overall it was great. Oh yeah, definitely. Actually, it exceeded my expectations a little bit. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure what to expect. 
we definitely got a lot of the scares coming at us, which is definitely a, a good experience if you go through a maze. Yeah. The visual was stunning. It always is stunning here in Orlando. Yeah. The mazes here are always awesome. So, yeah, I, I, I overall, I liked it. I don't know if it was worth almost two hours for a right. wait, but it was really, really good. But let's see how it compares to some of the other mazes here. You all like
Okay, everybody, it's time for something we look forward to every year. That's right, it is time for the iconic HHN pizza fries. And they're nice and hot too, like right out of the oven. Now, I got them with pepperoni and sausage, but my mom got them actually without. There's also a vegetarian version somewhere else in the park, but we're just gonna get it here. My mom uh, didn't want the pepperoni and sausage, but this looks really good, mom. The annual pizza fries. The annual, indeed. Well, they look really good. I'm gonna dive right in. These are a staple for HHN Orlando. And I gotta be honest, they have them in Hollywood, but they're just not the same as this. Hopefully that'll change this year, you never know. But why don't you try those, Mom? I'm going to add just a little bit of crushed pepper. Okay. And once I taste it, I'm gonna ask if I can get maybe a little more pizza sauce because that's what you gotta do. Absolutely. You could even get ranch and ketchup or I guess ketchup defeats the purpose of pizza fries, but ranch. Well, kind of. Ranch, I, I could go for that. Okay, me too. All right, here we go. Good? Really good. Yummy. How is it without the pepperoni and sausage? I like it. You like it that way? I'm not a sausage person. Sure. I'm not a pepperoni person. Fair enough. Uh, cheeky Coke. Iconic pizza fries. Lots of cheese. Lots of marinara. I'm trying to get the perfect bite. Here we go. <laughs> 10 out of 10, of course. Iconic, as always. Nice and hot and delicious delicious pepperonis, great fries. Oh my gosh. I'd be the happiest person in the world if they brought this version of pizza fries over to Hollywood. What do you think, Mom? I agree, 100%. Oh yeah. 10 out of 10. So good. Well, Mom, remember when we went to that super fun Renaissance Fair I in Irwindale? I That you, was so much yeah, fun. Yeah, we dressed up and we were very... Uh, do you want to go to another Renaissance Fair? Okay. 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 There's one just right over there. Yeah, I see, I see it. Let's go. This okay. is going to be great. Okay.
everybody I ordered the ghoul juice <laughs> I got this last year I think too I got it in the souvenir cup which lights up it was about 1850 so she's not cheap <laughs> she's not cheap it's a rum drink I think but the cup is always really cool and fun and it lights up because like look at it in the dark it's just so cool that I just couldn't turn down the opportunity to buy it so <laughs> we're gonna try it okay happy haunt season everybody <laughs> Rum base, very sweet, but it's good. It hits the spot. Mm -hmm. It has a little bit of rum in it, but the sugar is keeping me awake. So, cheers to that! Happy haunt season. Well, mom, we've had pizza fries. We went to the Ren Fair. I think it's time to maybe go into the further. What do you think? Okay, let's do a little bit of the further. Yeah, <laughs> and we'll try. It might take us 75 minutes to get there, but we'll get there eventually. It's worth it. <laughs> or actually, we change our minds. We might go hang out with a couple Ghostbuster friends. What do you think? Well, the inside is where you wait, so yeah. Yeah, we'll check it out. Um, I haven't seen Slimer in a while, so let's go visit him. The death chip. The power to kill by fear itself. The cold shiver runs down.
walking through Ghostbusters, didn't we, Mom? I loved the movie and I loved the maze. Yeah. yeah, it was it was a fun maze. It even had some pretty good scares. I did. Yeah, I would say it was it's scarier than the maze they had back in 2019. Agreed. A little, and the visual is stunning. I feel like I'm going to be spoiled after seeing the Ghostbusters in Orlando. I know, right? Huge. Yeah, just big uh, maze. Yeah, stunning. The visual of that maze was just beautiful and gorgeous. Um, but we are going to HHM Hollywood next week, a couple of days actually. So we'll have to compare the two then. We didn't get to go through Insidious, but I'm sure it is very insidious indeed. Terrifying. I mean, back in the day when Hollywood had Insidious, we would make people drop. And I say that because I was in the maze, actually. So I don't like to brag, but it's a pretty scary maze. It's known to always be really scary. So I think we can only expect good things from it, right? Good things. Yeah, that actually had the longest wait time tonight. How yeah. long was it? Oh my gosh, at one time, at least 75 minutes. Over, I think it was like 85 Eight, minutes. Oh, 85. 85, maybe even yeah. more, like at one part of the night. So it's a popular maze, but it'll make you drop. <laughs> so if you're looking for a scary maze, I would definitely recommend Insidious. Okay, what do you think the winner was for tonight, Mom? You know what? The winner, hands <laughs> down, is the Ren Fair. The Ren the Fair! The twisted, <laughs> scary Ren Fair. The creepy Ren Fair wins for the night, I it think. It did. And that, wow. Stunning. I'm so jealous we don't have that in Hollywood. Well, <laughs> applaud the team members. Yeah. Oh yeah, they were great. Uh, yeah, the Ren Fair was amazing. Pretty hard to beat. The mazes were great too, but uh, but it was creepy Ren Fair for the win for me tonight. Agreed. Well, Mom, tonight was our first haunt, technically speaking, for 2024. Pretty good beginning. Yeah, we're pretty tired though. It's so funny, I'm so tired that I feel like I just worked a haunt. It's funny when you feel just as tired attending a haunt as you do sometimes as a scare actor at the end of the night. I don't know, I guess you're doing a lot of walking around or something like that. But next on our list is HHN Hollywood, right? There you go. Next we week, fly home. Yep, we're flying home soon. Team member preview and then opening night of HHN. We can't wait. But for now, we're pretty tired, so it's time to head to our hotel and have spooky dreams. So stay safe out there. Stay spooky. And perhaps sometime we will see you at HHN Orlando. Have a great day, everybody. And thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.